हेलो स्टूडेंट्स एंड वेलकम बैक टू बैंक एग्जाम डॉट कॉम माय नेम इज़ रमनदीप सिंह स्टूडेंट्स इफ़ यू आर प्रिपेयरिंग फॉर आईबीपीएस एसओ मार्केटिंग स्केल वन मेंस एग्जाम देन इलास्टिसिटी ऑफ डिमांड इज़ अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक हर साल एक दो क्वेश्चंस आ जाते हैं एग्जाम में आपको ज़रूर पढ़ना चाहिए वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर योर एग्जाम वट काइंड ऑफ क्वेश्चन यू कैन एक्सपेक्ट आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू एट द एंड ऑफ द सेशन ठीक है पूरे एम भी करवाएंगे so ibps so marketing mains course we are doing it on bank exams today.com in which we are providing video classes notes quizzes and the test series link to join the course is available in the description we are also providing a power capsule aap power capsule bhi download kar sakte hain links are again available in the description please check right uh, let's start with the elasticity of demand what is elasticity of demand so students let's assume uh, that you want to purchase apples right you want to buy apples today right so the price of apples today is rupees 60 per kg right and you go to the market and you buy 2 kg of apples right that's that's general that's normally what you do roza aap regular yahi karte ho whenever you want to buy apples ab market jaate ho 120 rupees leke and then you buy 2 kg of apple tomorrow uh, you are going to the market and the price of apples is now rupees let's say 120 rupees per kg the price has doubled how much would you purchase right ab kitna apple purchase karoge 1 kilo 1.5 kilo ya pure 2 kilo right so that change that change in demand ab kitna purchase karoge that is what elasticity of demand is the effect of change in price on the demand right on the quantity demanded the elasticity of demand is the degree to which demand for goods and services change with the change in price of goods so uh, price is not the only factor ekalota factor nahi hai price can be the factor income of the buyer can be another factor right so uh, let's assume you are making your family income is rupees 20000 per month that's your family income right so which cooking oil you are using ab kaun sa cooking oil use karte ho right uh, maybe you are using refined refined oil right now refined cooking oil right now but if your family income goes to let's say 50000 rupees मे बी यू आर गोइंट टू यूज लेस ऑफ रिफाइंड ऑयल आपका रिफाइंड ऑयल का जो कंजम्पन है वो कम हो जाएगा यू आर गोइंट टू यूज लेस अमाउंट ऑफ रिफाइंड ऑयल मे बी यू आर गोइंट टू यूज मोर बटर आप बटर ज़्यादा यूज़ करने लग जाओगे ऑलिव ऑयल यूज ज़्यादा करोगे ऑलिव ऑयल बटर घी वो आप ज़्यादा यूज़ करने लग जाओगे दैट्स वेरी कॉमन change in price of substitutes uh, of goods and services uh, so substitutes ke agar prices badhte hain if the price of tea goes up substantially 30 40% iske prices maan lijiye chai ke badh jate hain people are going to consume more of coffee log jo hai coffee zyada consume karna shuru kar denge if the price of coca cola increases agar coca cola ke price increase ho jate hain and uh, the prices of uh, pepsi doesn't increase people will uh, you know substitute pepsi with coke right log uh, pepsi zyada peen uh, jo hai coke ko replace kar denge pepsi ke sath so that's very common replacements hoti hain very common right so change in price of substitutes of uh, goods or services these are the three major reasons behind elasticity uh, behind uh, your uh, uh, behind change in quantity demanded three reasons are change in price change in income of the buyer and change in price of substitute products substitute or complementary products right agar price of butter increases the price of butter increases uh the demand for bread may be decreased right agar butter mehanga ho gaya aur bread butter generally log ek sath consume karte hain agar butter bahut mehanga ho raha hai to log bread obviously kam consume karenge right so that these are the factors these are complementary products right uh cars agar bahut mehangi ho gayi hain cars ke prices 50% agar bad rahe hain to uh log cars kam uh, jo purchase karenge so tires bhi kam 
कंज्यूम होंगे दीज आर कॉम्प्लीमेंट्री प्रोडक्ट्स सो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस द इलास्टिसिटी ऑफ डिमांड इन द इन द नेक्स्ट स्लाइड्स होल्ड ऑन सो लेट्स जस्ट रिमूव दिस ओके so the price if the price of apple increases people will buy fewer apples and hence the demand will fall very common if the price uh, the income of a person rises he will buy more and hence the demand increases if the price of coffee decreases people will buy more coffee and less of tea tea ka price wahi hai lekin agar coffee ke prices 30 40% kam ho jate hain to log coffee kharidenge zyada aur tea kam kharidenge right so these are common examples so uh, the elasticity of demand it's of three types price elasticity income elasticity and cross elasticity price elasticity income elasticity and cross elasticity these are three types of demands right so we are uh, firstly going to focus on price elasticity of demand the effect of price on quantity demanded price elasticity is defined as percentage change in quantity demanded divided by percentage change in the price the effect of price on quantity demanded okay so price elasticity is defined as percentage change in demand for an item uh, with a unit percentage change in the price of that particular item theek hai demand pe kya effect pada hai price ke uh, change hone se right so types of price elasticity first of all elastic demand so what do you mean by elastic demand when absolute value of price elasticity of demand is greater than 1 that means percentage change in quantity demanded is greater than price change elastic demand means price has huge impact मान लीजिए प्राइस अगर 10% चेंज हुआ है तो प्राइस 10% बढ़ गया तो डिमांड जो है 20 परसेंट घट गई राइट सो प्राइस हैज मोर इम्पैक्ट दिस मीन्स दैट परसेंटेज चेंज इन क्वांटिटी डिमांडेड इज ग्रेटर देन परसेंटेज चेंज इन प्राइस फॉर एग्जांपल लग्जरी आइटम्स लग्जरी आइटम्स में दैट हैपन्स इफ द एलवी बैग्स दे गॉट एक्सपेंसिव बाय 20 परसेंट पीपल में स्विच देयर देयर चॉइसिस कुछ और परचेज कर लें कोई और ब्रांड परचेज कर लेंगे राइट right? so this is the diagram for the elastic demand if the see this much change this much change leads to this much see quantity demanded mein zyada effect pad jata hai if the price increases it has more impact it has more impact on quantity demanded agar price 10% bad gaya to quantity demanded 15% kam ho gayi that is that is what elastic demand is whereas what is inelastic demand price doesn't have that much impact price ka impact kam hai agar price 10% bad gaya price increased by 10% demand would decrease by just 5 7% right demand pe utna effect nahi hai right so that's a good example when absolute uh, elasticity price elasticity of demand is less than 1 इनअलास्टिक डिमांड मीन्स प्राइस इलास्टिसिटी ऑफ डिमांड इज लेस देन वन ठीक है इलास्टिक डिमांड मीन्स इलास्टिक डिमांड मीन्स प्राइस इलास्टिसिटी ऑफ डिमांड इज मोर देन वन प्लीज रिमेंबर दैट इट इट इज इम्पॉर्टेंट फॉर फ्रॉम एग्जामिनेशन पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू ओके सो लेट्स मूव ऑन टू द नेक्स्ट स्लाइड या सो अ गुड एग्जाम्पल ऑफ इन इलास्टिक डिमांड so if the price of insulin increases by 10% people will continue you know uh, using the insulin injections obviously many very few people are going to stop using it or let's take an example of wheat atta wheat so if the price of wheat increases by 10% agar atta 10% mehanga ho jaye how many people will stop consuming wheat how many people will stop consuming rice right so many few if the pr price of wheat increases by 10% its demand may decrease by 2 3% right uh, and people will shift to maybe rice or some other products but that won't have that much impact 
price increase won't have that much impact on the quantity demanded it has inelastic demand right so this is the example right so if the price increases by if you, when you say uh, te- if, if it goes from 10 to 20 it doesn't have that much impact on quantity demanded when the price was 10 quantity demanded was 10 when the price was 20 quantity demanded is 8 to utna effect nahi hai right unitary elastic demand that means when absolute value of price elasticity uh, of demand is exactly one unitary means el- el- exactly one the change in quantity demand uh, quantity demanded it has equal effect the percentage change in quantity demanded is equal to percentage change in price agar price increase hua hai 10% price is increased by 10% demand would also decrease by 10% if price is increased by 10% demand would decrease by 10% same right so this is unitary elastic so this this x is equal to x here okay quantity demanded is equal to the change in uh, the change in price is equal to the change in quantity demanded okay what do you mean by perfectly elastic demand when uh, it is u- uh, usually not possible generally all the items they are kind of uh, slightly inelastic or elastic but perfectly elastic it is kind of uh, not possible so when price elasticity of demand is infinite any slight change in price leads to infinite change in quantity demanded not uh, not actually possible but uh, in a perfectly competitive market uh, perfectly competitive market is actually also not possible for identical goods a slight change in price may lead to you know uh, total drop in the demand let's say uh, there is a market where people sell uh, what do you say jaggery where people sell jaggery everybody is selling the jaggery at rupees 80 per kg that is a market rate everybody is selling at 80 rupees somebody started selling it for 85 rupees per kg but still the competitors are selling it at 80 rupees sab log aise pe bech rahe aap 85 pe bech rahe nobody is going to buy from you so everybody is going to switch that is perfectly elastic demand uh, so this is the diagram for perfectly elastic demand let me just show that to you that is a perfectly elastic demand a slight change in the price leads to infinite change in the quantity demanded halka sa price change karke aapka quantity demanded bilkul zero bhi ho sakta hai right what, then what do you mean by perfectly inelastic demand the demand of salt let's say the price of salt goes to rupees 200 per kg would you stop consuming salt no you will continue uh, using salt obviously so the price elasticity uh, uh, the, pr- the price elasticity of demand for the salt is zero the change in price has no effect on the change in quantity demanded price change hone ka koi effect nahi hai quantity demanded pe it is zero for certain certain drugs certain medicines for, for example kuch aisi medicines hai um, for vitamin c vitamin c there is a one common uh, drug uh, limsi that's a common brand right so i guess uh, for 15 tabs it is rupees 20 during covid the demand for this uh, tablet increased many fold right so the price of this uh, particular uh, see uh, that increased to rupees 60 but still people continued consuming it because it's uh, it, it's required right to avoid infections you need it so same goes for the salt same goes for many drugs many many medicines even if the price increase is is increased by 40 50 percent 100 percent people will still uh, continue uh, using it uh, still continue buying it usko purchase karte rahenge. even see if the price goes to 10 20 40 50 people will continue purchasing it right factors affecting the price elasticity of demand the availability of substitutes so there is no substitute of salt so because there is no substitute of salt its demand is uh, its price elasticity of demand is inelastic 
coffee has a substitute uh, tea has a substitute even milk has a substitute but uh, the level of substitution also differs right so tea and coffee they are not perfect substitutes people who are drinking tea they'll continue drinking tea right the people who are uh, uh, drinking coffee they'll continue drinking coffee right necessity versus luxury necessities tend to have inelastic demand luxuries have more elastic demand right so proportion of income goods that take up large proportion of income tend to have more elastic demand while uh, the uh, the goods which are uh, small which are a small proportion of your income a good example is salt salt is like 40 50 rupees per kg obviously your income is more than that if the price of salt increases by 100%, you'll still uh, buying the same amount of salt, right? Time period demand usually becomes elastic over the long run as consumer finds alternatives. Long period may you'll you'll find alternatives for products, right? Let's uh, do the next topic that is income uh, elasticity. So we'll do this uh, tomorrow now, okay? So students, tomorrow we are going to do uh, the income elasticity of demand and the cross elasticity of demand for IBPS SO Marketing 2025 main course. Uh, link to join the course is available in the description. You should check the description. We are providing video classes, notes, quizzes and the test series. And Power Capsule is also there in the course. You should get it. The link to join the course is available in the description. This is my WhatsApp number where you can ask your doubts and we are going to answer your doubt. This is my personal WhatsApp number. Ask your doubts anytime. I'm going to answer your doubts. List of our successful students. All these students that took our courses in the past and they cracked their respective exams and I'm really, really happy for them. You can be one of them in the future. And yes, you will be one of them in the future. If there is any doubt in your mind, please ask your doubts. Uh, my WhatsApp number is always there. Uh, and that's all for today, students. Thank you and have a very nice day. Bye-bye.